It's time to journey once again into the dark depths of Japan. The proud birthplace of eel ketchup, robot sex mates, and best of all, 2D fighting games. This week's installment is Tatsunoku vs. Capcom. Now, if you're wondering what the hell Tatsunoko is, we have you covered. It's a popular Japanese animation house responsible for animes like Space Ace and Yatterman. Okay, so you probably aren't all that familiar, but for a select few otaku, the idea of using the characters of Tatsunoku to beat up on Ryu from Street Fighter is enough to give them a nerdgasm. So, who's in? Well, besides the usual Capcom suspects, expect to play as Ken the Eagle, Neo Human Cashern, Doranjo, Keras, and a bunch more iconic anime stars. So, will this game ever come out to American shores? The answer is a resounding no. First off, the characters aren't nearly as recognizable as Capcom's roster. Secondly, many of the animes have been licensed by different companies in the U.S., meaning that clearing the American rights to show them all in one game would be a logistical nightmare. Careful! That's kind of a shame, because we had a fun time beating up on the usual Capcom stars with a fresh crew of oddly dressed weirdos. Yeah, I'm talking to you. If you're hellbent on seeing Keras fight alongside Chun-Li, and let's face it, who isn't, it looks like you'll just have to import this one. And trust us when we say, it's only made in Japan. I think someone must have spiked my vodka this morning. And it's not because I'm seeing more colored tracers of George Harrison during Diwali, but because it says here that our first perfect score of the year is a fighter on the Wii. The combat is fun. The AI is formidable. And did Frank West just get a Technicolor dream coat? Tatsunoko vs. Capcom Ultimate All-Stars is the perfect fighting game for the Wii. It's got a simple combat system that'll let all the grandmas, kiddies, and junkies who own Nintendo's Good Time Fun Box to pull off some seizure-inducing combos, even if they don't have any fighter training. But it also has some in-depth fighting mechanics for the more refined palette. Like the other versus games, you'll have multiple characters on your squad who you'll be able to tag in and out of the match. Tatsunoko vs. Capcom also has all the series' standard game modes, arcade versus survival, time attack, and training mode. Beating the arcade mode like it was Martha Coakley will unlock costumes, earn you in game cash, and more characters to play with. Oh, no! Tatsunoko vs. Capcom has 26 characters for you to play with. Characters you know and love, like Ryu and Chun-Li. <laughs> and a whole bunch of characters that'll probably be less recognizable to you than Hu Tao or Ali Khamenei. Do yourself a favor, and like that hunk of octopus sashimi your girlfriend talked you into trying, take a bite from Tatsunoku's plate. The characters are fun and all play very differently. You're sure to find one that fits your style if you just pinch your nose and swallow. Like Plex the Magic Robot says, try it, you might like it. Although, I'm sure I'll still run into a ton of reuse online. Speaking of online, Tatsunoko vs. Capcom has it, and it works well. Well, good for the Wii. You won't get all the bells and whistles you get on PSN or Xbox Live, but with a stored list of friends and rivals, you won't have to exchange codes to have some quick online fist-to-face -face interactions. That's why Tatsunoko vs. Capcom Ultimate All-Stars gets a 5. Out of five. Whoa. Yeah!